Hey there, we're still going to be doing NCR quests with Boone today. I know that in order to unlock his companion fulfillment stuff, he probably just wants to kill a bunch of Legion with me, but I'm not worried about that right now because we're totally going to get around to killing the Legion later. They're already sending death squads after me, so that'll help as time goes on. But right now, I want to get this quest out of our quest log because we've had it here forever. It's been here forever, and I hate Cook Cook. I hate him. I hate him specifically so much ever since I first heard about him, and I definitely want to try to do this optional thing and kill his pet cow, Queenie, so that he goes insane and then kills all of his friends. That sounds like it could be maybe amusing to watch, but before we go and do that, we still have the ending follow-up part of Left My Heart, which is that we need to talk to Frank Weathers about how we freed his family from slavery. I've come here to Aerotech Office Park just to do that, as you probably already noticed, but I'm a little bit worried. I'm just a little bit worried because uh, if you remember, they don't want anything to do with him anymore because apparently he's super abusive, which is kind of a surprise because whenever I talked to him the first time, I didn't really get any vibes that he was like horrible, like abuser level horrible. But I mean, I guess you can't always tell who's an abuser and who's not. I don't know. I just feel like he's not going to like this information. I hope he doesn't get defensive about it. And also, I'm not even sure his family survived, guys, because I was trying to escort them out of the goodness of my heart. So I followed them all the way from Cottonwood Cove up past Novak. And then they kind of disappeared in this stretch of road somewhere. So they were absolutely on their way up to Freeside. And I'm not sure they made it. I'm really not sure if they made it, so... Things are getting stranger every day. Oh, you sound like your wife. She said the same thing. Have you found my family yet? Uh, yeah. That's what I'm here to talk to you about. Yes. Have you found them? Well, yes. And they're alive. Probably. Probably alive. They are? Oh my god, thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. But wait. Where are they? Okay, so about that, we can try to extort caps out of him for that information. Oh, we leveled up. And that's going to be level 34, right? So we're ready to pick another perk. Okay. Um, I'll agonize over which one to choose in a second. I'm not going to do that because that's slimy. I will probably do this one because the speech option sounds pretty good. I hope we can actually convince him to clean up his act so that he'll be nice to them. I can just call him an abuser and not be helpful. Or I can tell him where they went, which is apparently to the old Mormon fort in Freeside. I guess they told me this, but it just completely flew past me and slipped my mind. So I'm going to encourage him to do better. You're right. I've been a mean son of a bitch the past couple years. It won't be easy, but I'll try going sober. Maybe then my family will want me back. I hope Thank so, Thank you for Frank. doing what you can. I won't let this go to waste. Don't let it go to waste. Make the most out of every day. Okay, I can put survival at 96. I'm really just hoping I can find one more skill book of each of these so that I can get them put at the top. And for our remaining points, I can start putting them into guns explosives, melee weapons, sneak, or unarmed. So out of all of these, I'm tempted to just start putting them in guns because wasn't there a joint energy weapon and gun perk? Maybe I can even get it now. So I'm going to go ahead and do continue. There were other ones as well. I just don't know if there were any other ones that I would want. The ones that rely on stats, if it's not stats that I already have, I'm pretty just certain that I'm not going to get it. But we will just look around a little bit here. Here's one. Okay, so Mad Bomber. My intimate knowledge of gadgets and explosives combined to make me the Mad Bomber at workbenches. I have special explosive recipes that I can unlock for use. That one's pretty interesting. I mean, I don't know if I would use it. I'm kind of like completely neglecting explosives this time around. But 
I don't know. New recipes are always fun. I guess I could add this to the list of things that I learn how to do and then don't do because <laughs> they just sound fun, but then I just kind of get distracted and do other things. There was another one. There's, I mean, more than one, but there was another one that I might potentially get for me. Oh, there it is. Okay. Concentrated fire. With concentrated fire, my accuracy to hit any body part in vats increases slightly with each subsequent hit on that body part. And this could be useful for me because I don't know if you noticed, but whenever I do vats, I kind of just like open it. I pick a body part. Sometimes it's not even <laughs> the one with the highest chance to hit. I mean, I try to pick the highest chance to hit, but sometimes I just go like, duh, 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 like <laughs> just pick one. Uh, so it's not like I'm spreading out my fire. So concentrated fire might be useful to me. We're not going to get ninja. No way. Uh, burden to bear. That's six strength and six endurance. The wastelander with the most gear wins or at least survives. I can carry an additional 50 pounds of gear and it stacks with the strong back perk. Okay. Broad daylight. Yeah, that's where we can sneak with the pit boy on. I want to look at strong back really quick. We need more strength and endurance. Actually, I think we have five strength. It was endurance that I left a point out of, right? And I can carry 50 pounds more of equipment with that. Um, okay, well, I don't have anything fixing up our endurance right now, but we could change that. We could change that right now. I probably should have been doing this the whole time you know, intense training here or there. Maybe I should tag some more skills. I don't know. But what I do know is that this is probably what I'm going to pick for right now. Yeah, tag. So I could tag something up. Or I have high repair skill. I could just go ahead and try to get the mad bomber thing. And then I would probably go to the workbench look at the recipes and then never think about it again because I am the worst. <laughs> so I'm going to do intense training and we will put one point into endurance and that's going to let us get strong back. We're not going to be able to get the other one, but at least we could do this. If only I had done this before this year, Madre, huh? Okay. Well, Frank, can I talk to you some more? Thank you for your kindness, stranger. You're welcome. Goodbye. Goodbye. Good luck with your family. I think I will actually go pay them a visit before we go get Cook Cook, but I'm still gonna slap that quest back on. Wait, no, 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 this one. Although I guess we could also do Debt Collector because like, they're just up here in Freeside. Like that's not even, probably a hard quest to do. I don't know why I haven't done it yet, but whatever. Whatever. Maybe I'll do that with a different follower companion. Hmm? What do you think? So, the quest marker for Cook Cook and Queenie is over that way. I'm pretty sure this one is just leading me back inside to change the bounty. So, we're going to ignore that. We're going to go this way. The little broken down motel the El Rey Motel. Looks really familiar. I guess it just looks like the one in, in Novak, kind of. With the stairs and stuff. Can we go in it? We can. I'm not sure that we should. But we can do it. We can do it. And it's scorpions. I'm a little woozy, but that's quite alright. Whoa. Very wooz. Please stop. I want to read this note threatening note. The note reads, your debt still remains unpaid. We warned you twice. There will not be a third warning. Only consequences. You have one day. Did they, did they murder a man with scorpions? Did they? I think they did. Sunset Sarsaparillas. And the woozy's gone. Whoa. That's it, right there. That's the consequences. You found them. 
You only had like a few caps. Was it really worth it? Was it? Was it worth it? Is there something down there? Just a tin can? I thought it looked like there was something else, but I guess that's just decorations. Okay, let's go out from this place. Probably. I think so. Yeah, okay. He should have put those glasses on and then been like, you won't hit a guy with glasses, will ya? I mean, it wouldn't have worked and he would still be dead, but it's it's funny to think about him doing that. It looks like there's another one we can go in here. This one's locked. But that doesn't typically stop me. Hi. Did you overdose? This guy overdosed on medics, I'm pretty sure. Okay, that's unfortunate. Anyone else in here? Someone in the bathroom dead, maybe? No? Not at all? Whoa, they stuck the Teddy's head down the drain. Well, that's sad. Teddy, can you come out, please? Teddy? No? Whoa, that's cursed. That's really... I'm gonna take it. That's my teddy now. That's my cursed teddy now. I can take him home. I can sit him somewhere. And we can remember the good old days when we had cursed teddies or something. Yeah, that makes sense. That sounds right. That sounds right. Okay. Looks like there is another room here. Another locked room, but we can get in. Please don't be dead, person. Over here. Oh, hi. Um, well... He's dead! Okay. Sorry about that. Pre-war casual wear. Empty dressers. Is there, like, anything worth having in any of these places? What was this guy on a back? Oh, he was crazed. Okay. He has nice folded clothing everywhere. Is that like what he does when he gets hopped up on drugs? Ooh. He goes around folding clothes. Wait, would it be funny if there was another one under the... Oh. It would have been funny. Come on, game. Do do stuff. Do, do stuff like that. That would, that would be silly. And then we'd get two in one location and that would be wild. That's definitely Tranquility Lane. Don't you think so? Okay. Well. Is there a downstairs one I can go in? I don't think so. These are all, like, pretty wrecked. Other than, like, the one I've already been in. Do you have anything to say? Are you a drug addict? Prim is a new sheriff. That should keep the powder gangers away. You are a drug addict. And also, you've just got, like, the most unfortunate face. Hi. That tower on the strip? The one you can see for miles? I hear it ain't sealed up no more. Her voice does not go with her face. Her nose is, like, bigger than her eyeballs. Her nose is, like, huge. I bet she can sniff, like, anything from anywhere. If she was a detective, they would call her the nose. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop bullying this NPC. <laughs> um, let's go this way. I see an NCR man. What are you doing? Are you keeping the hostels back? What's over there that we need to worry about? Is it the fiends? We're getting pretty close to Vault 3, right? Oh, I see one of them. Yeah, it's like right back behind here. Should I kill them or nah? Because we're going to make Cook Cook go crazy and start killing his friends. But he's like over here and this is like right there. So, probably I should kill these. I'm assuming we're heading, like, right over there. Whoa, please don't push me. Please don't. I am only me. And I do not want push. Oh, really? Take him out. Ugh. 
Who said cut it out, will you? Was that you, NCR man? Are you okay? Are you okay? I think that guy's a little gun- that scared me to death. That scared me right to death. I think that guy's a little gun shy. Get it? Get it? Because there was guns and then he got shy and now he's hiding over there. Hi. Do you think I'm funny, sir? You know, if you were serving, you'd probably be halfway to general by now. <laughs> Thanks. Is it even possible to serve? I don't get the vibe that it is. But if I was serving, I would be halfway to general by now. I bet I would be even higher than that. Maybe. I'd be like a lieutenant or something. That would be cool. Lieutenant May. I would like it. Do you like it, Boone? I bet he does. So there's more hostels everywhere. Oh. Yay! I hit him for her. I think it's a her. Right? You're mine. Please die. Whoa, Boone, don't do that. You're messing me up, bud. Let's get that one over there. Whoa. Okay, let's get these over here, too. I mean, I guess. Why not? Whoa. Oh, they gave up. Come on, Boone, you're a sniper. Whoa, look at that. Fly in the sky. Murderer? Me? Y'all fiends. Like... This isn't even murder, this is cleaning up the trash. Okay, what do you have? I'll take your weapon and your ammo. But you can keep your gear because it's trash. It's probably only good for repairing other gear. And I don't have time for that right now. I don't even have any other gear on me that I want repaired. So I will just... Do this. Do this thing. I clicked cancel in that first attempt to loot the ammo because I wanted to see if I could loot all of it at once. And I can't! Take him out. Maybe this is a bad Eat idea. This. Because like I said, we're supposed to be driving Cook Cook Insane. So it's probably not in the spirit of things for me to go around killing all of these fiends. Also, I don't want to accidentally kill Cook Cook because I need his head intact for the bounty, obviously. And my laser weapons are not exactly good for that, but they're also all I've got. So I'm going to keep using them. But I'm going to try to be careful. Okay, so we need to go over that way. Okay, where exactly is Queenie going to be? One of these is Cook Cook and one of these is Queenie. I think I'm going to sneak. And maybe park our friends. I think I'll park our friends like right about here. If I get in trouble, I can run back through this little gap and then I'll have support. So Boone, if you would wait here. I'll sit tight. Thank you. Eddie, you two please sit here with Boone. And there's more hostels that way. Is that going to be more fiends? I want to be very stealthy about this, guys. Should I go ahead and take a stealth boy? I mean, they're not very far away. Like, they're right over there. Oh, caution? Okay, let's take the stealth boy now. And maybe it would have been wise to bring Lily for this mission. Because my granny 
knows how to stay quiet. So that one over there is going to be Cook Cook. So I can't tell which one he is. And this one is going to be Queenie. So there are fiends like patrolling out here. And I'm worried they're going to see me even with the stealth boy on. Man, go back the other direction. I'm trying to like target one of these cows. Good grief. So which one of these is going to be Queenie? When I Probably. Find you. I'm gonna eat your spleen. Okay, probably that one because it's bigger than the others. Do you think you're doing well? Oh, hey, no. Look, girl, chill, please. I'm just trying to, like, make Cook Cook kill all of them. Yikes, did I incinerate myself? I did incinerate myself! That's, like, mildly infuriating. I mean, <laughs> I guess it's not a surprise. <laughs> okay, let's do that again. <laughs> Wait, 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 hey. Nose. Prim is a new sheriff. That should keep the powder gangers away. Mm-hmm. Is this joke a little on the nose? <laughs> okay. I mean, she's not that bad. I just... I don't know. Okay? I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know. Maybe I should park... Boone and Eddie further back. Or maybe I should just go ahead and run in. I don't know. I mean, I killed Queenie. That was Queenie. Fairly sure that was Queenie. Yeah. But then everything else got messed up. So, at least I can identify Queenie. Queenie is bigger than the other Brahmin. And standing slightly behind them. So I guess she would be standing in front of them if I approached from the other direction. Is that even possible? I mean, it probably is, but... I'm not gonna worry about that. We can skirt these mountains, and we can go over, and we can shoot Queenie. And then I'm just gonna try to enjoy the beautiful sight of Cook <laughs> uh, Getting in a fight with his dudes. So these are ones that I fought last time. Oh, there you guys are. I was so worried. Okay. I'm not gonna fight them this time, but I am gonna look in these dumpsters. Nothing too much. I mean, I guess I'll take the cigarettes. I guess I'll take the cigarettes. And then... I'll put Boone and Eddie at about the same place as last time. Because really, they had nothing to do with the bad stuff that happened. I just Contact. want them out of the way. Who? Contact with who? Oh, we already did this, though. Like, come on. No, that's not what I want. I mean, I actually don't want the compliance regulator at all. But, okay, well, you know, there we go. Just let your friends handle it. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Maybe if I'm not at half health, I won't incinerate myself this time. What do you think? Boonie, wait here. I'll sit. Eddie, come over here by Boon. Come over here by Boon. There you go, cutie. Wait here. Okay. And now I'm ready to go. With a I'm not even going to be hidden at the beginning. I'm going to get a little bit closer. I'm going to go around this pile of rubble. And then I'm going to sneak. And hopefully those fiends will be pathing around a little bit differently. Because that one chick just had like super unfortunate, you know, timing. That was like some wrong place, wrong time stuff. And there's like some more of them over there. Okay, that's fine. I'll worry about them later. I've got ramen to hunt right now. So there she is. Just stay over there. Let me go over this way and get an eye on Queenie. The big one. I feel like it would be easy for me to aggro those over that way. From here as well. 
I just want a shot of Queenie. I'm not trying to kill all of the Brahmin. So, in theory, he should now be totally down with the idea of attacking his friends. And I do hear gunshots. I hear gunshots and... I see fire. I bet that's Cook Cook. He just roasty toasted that princess that died with me. Mm. Is he the only one left? I don't see any other marks on the map, but it could just be that I'm too far away to see them. Cookie, where are you? Are you crazy? What are you doing? You're running into a wall. You are crazy. What are you doing? No, don't kill the Brahmin! Are you kidding? Are you crazy? I specifically did my best to keep those things alive. Are you punching that one? Hey! Get back here, you wuss! You know what? I am gonna switch to the compliance regulator because I wanna make- it Hey! Are you running? You know, for some reason, I thought you were some kind of crazy guy who would be, like, all about it. You're, like, a wuss. You're a total wuss. And I want to kill you in a way so that you don't probably lose, I don't know, your head. Get it? Don't lose your head, right? So I'm just kind of, kind of, I mean, just gonna, I'm just going to kind of, like, you know, go for the, go for the kneecaps. How about this? You like it? I'm really bad with melee weapons, Cook Cook. But I'm sure that probably hurts. There we go. There we go. What you got, dude? He has 20 gauge ammo. His head that I need. Flamer fuel. Mentats. A lever action shotgun. Metal armor. And a raider arc light helmet. Oh, gross. That's like when you take the legs off a mantis. Ew. Ew. Yeah, mine is like ruined. Mine is like ruined, ruined. There we go. Like it never was a problem. Gross. Okay, well, how am I even like, lo like looting his head if that's like that? Ugh, it's gross. Okay. Uh, I'll take the ammo of the other fiends. I'll put my weapon of choice back on. Oh, yeah. I forgot about the hands. I forgot about the hands. I don't like the hands. I don't need a hand. Ha ha ha. Okay, that was a little funny. Not like very funny, but a little funny. Hey, princess. No, you kind of killed me. I mean, like, not really. That was my own fault. But also, it was, you know, it was your fault. How dare you? So, this one survived. Yay! I saved you. You're welcome. I'm sorry about this one. She looks kind of fabulous, though. That's a very nice pose. I actually only want to loot the Brahmin meat from Queenie. I'm assuming Queenie has Brahmin meat. And then I can, you know, put it on display or in a unique container and be like, that's Queenie. What is this? Recipe for Cook Cook's Fiend Stew. What is that? Is that going to be a note? This recipe allows you to make Cook Cook's Fiend Stew. Oh! Okay. And we have the memo to return to Private Morales. We can do that. Is there a cooking fire here somewhere that I can look at this recipe? What is Cook Cook's stew? Ramen meat, beer. Oh, please don't make that sound. I hate it. No. No. Why does it do that? Okay, it's done. 
Beer, Brahmin meat, fresh potato, and jalapeno. Okay. Well, I saw potatoes and jalapenos over here. There's also some carrots. And there's more Brahmin meat, but I'm not going to take it because I want to only have the, the queenie meat. So what is this? South Vegas Ruins West Entrance. Okay. And there is a hostel this way somewhere. Who is it? What's going on? Oh, wow. Look, a lot just loaded in. Looks like that's just like a, a dude and his dogs. Like a fiend dude and his fiend dogs. Okay. I mean, I guess I can wipe them out. I guess I can do that. So what should I do first? Should I kill the, the dogs? Or the person? I mean, the dogs are just out here making targets for themselves. Dude, that's weird looking. That was a guard dog. Okay. Person's a little upset by this. Violetta. Is that that named fiend dog? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is this going to be that other fiend one for the bounty? You know? Am I about to, like, get in trouble? Okay, so this is another one that I'm going to need to, like, be careful with. Okay, yeah, I don't want to, like, you know, not get my bounty stuff. I mean, I'm assuming that my reputation is good enough that if I did, you know, just, like completely, you know, mess it up so that I can't even ever loot the bounty item. They probably trust me enough that if I was like, yo, this is the person you wanted dead, they'd probably be like, okay, good job. If you were in the ranks, you'd probably be general by now. I'm trying to like kill your dogs first because I just want to upset you personally. That wrong of me. I think I'm gonna also take a medex. I mean, I have plenty of it, and she's like damaging me a bit. I'm gonna go behind this rock. Then I'm gonna see about her doggies. I don't see any doggies. That's not gonna stop me from trying. Yes, I'm aware I'm out in the open right now. I made a quick save, so I should be fine. Hi. Let me just actually... Wait, wasn't there another one over there? Yeah, there's another one. Is that a dog? That was a dog, right? Hello? Oh, yeah. Chill out, chill out, chill out. Oh, look, he chilled out. He chilled out. And... Now... He peaced out. Bye! There's dirty water, but I don't really want that. I don't even really want that. Watch this not even be the bounty person that I think it is. Maybe y'all are out there like, Macy, that's not it. You can tell by looking at the character model. Well, you know, that doesn't really do me any favors, does it? If I don't know what I'm looking for, I'm not going to know when I find it or not. So I'm just going to work on the assumption I'm not that since... Let you get away. Okay, like, that's fine. Ew, what the heck? Is that a body? Okay, yeah, you sound like totally normal and healthy for sure. 
Oh, hi. That's kind of scary. Yeah, alright. I'm gonna just, like, you know, stay distance away from you. Get the fuck away from me! I mean, all your dogs are dead, so that's pretty much what I wanted. Are you- are you like you... the sight of your own blood? Okay, uh, do you like the sight of your dead entire pack of dogs? Person who I'm assuming is important some way? Like, not to me. You're never gonna be important to me. Or in the grand scheme of things, honestly. But you're important for a quest, so, you know, bravo for that. You know what? Let's drink a Sunset Sarsaparilla, too. Let's see if we get a star bottle cap. Just a regular bottle cap. Okay, that's fine. So, yeah, Violet, you've got a name. So I'm just going to go for your leg. Maybe just one. Maybe just one go for the leg. This leg. Did that hurt you enough? That didn't really hurt you enough. Let's switch to the compliancy regulady. Okay, let's see if we can just get her down. Please. Down, please. Like your dogs. Good girl. Okay, now we're gonna give her a treat to make sure she's learned her lesson. So, that right in the foot and the kneecap. Come on. I mean, not not really. Not unless you jump scare me. Come on. You're supposed to be learning. I told you. I told you down. You didn't stay, though. You have to stay. Stay. Okay? We gotta teach her, guys. Right? She's learning. Come on, now. There we go. See? There we go. And now she's all trained. Very good. Let's take all of this stuff. And there's her head. So there's one more. Ugh. Ah, I prefer if she didn't. It's okay though. Okay, should I just go ahead and try to find the other one then? Since I'm already doing this? Like, that's two out of three. I mean, it's not like it's hard for me to ask for details on the third part of the bounty. But this is going pretty well. You know, pretty well. I think we're on the wrong side of this. Maybe I should go through that entrance into the ruins? I'm willing to bet this is where the last person we need would be. And whenever I go in there, I think I'm just gonna rile the whole place up. Because they're all like really tightly packed together. There's like nobody in this part. And then there's like a bunch down here. So I'm gonna make another quick save and I'm just gonna try to be careful and I'm gonna hope the guy's in here. Is he in here or is he in the vault itself? You thought you could hide me. Okay, that's just a regular fiend. And you? I'm gonna make you scream. I don't think you are, but you know, I just like prefer if you chilled out, please. I can't be near you when you die. So I need you to fall over like that and just, just stay there. Thanks. So your friend is behaving and staying far enough away. Okay. So there's some of them. What's this one's name again? Wasn't it like... Nephi? Nephi? I know it wasn't Narfi, because that's from a different game. So let's take this and those. Their armor is just absolute trash. I mean, it, it can be used to repair other armor, as I've said, but I'm just not going to worry about it at the moment. There's too many of these guys. They've all got, like, the same crap that I don't feel strongly about. How come I can loot more than one of other items at once, but then whenever it's not a chem or an empty casing or a drained thing I have to like click the little prompt button I want to be able to auto loot the ammunitions okay here they come kind of are you one of them no that was just a fiend thankfully I need to be careful because I'm gonna nuke these guys 
And then one of them's gonna be the name cure Neuron. Okay, so keep your distance. Stay away from me, okay? Thanks. And you. Look at that. With racer fly so high. Okay. okay. Am I wrong? Is the person like not even in here? There's so many fiends though. Like they've got to be in here. I want to pick up this weapon that went zoom. Looks like a plasma rifle. You've been on a trip, little friend. Now you're mine. I see that one. I think that was just a regular fiend too. And you? I should probably be using vats to tell the names of these. <laughs> I'll make another quick save, because this could go, like, really wrong at any point. Okay. Yep, yeah, that's a thing. This weapon's just flying, too. Oh, look, it almost landed at my feet. That's pretty cute. And you, sir, fiend. Look at this. Hollow rifle shot. It's pretty cool looking. The projectile? I don't think I've commented on it. And if I have, I clearly haven't done so enough. I really like the projectile of this weapon. I don't think I should go that way, so let's go around. Yeah, I'm just destroying these guys. I'm just eating through them. Like a Sunday salad. Of course it's an expression, guys. What, you've never heard of eating through it like a Sunday salad? Hmm? Well, you're just uncultured. I'm actually kidding. I made that up right now. If you like it, please. Please credit me. Be like, oh, my funny friend thought this up. And I can be like, yes, I am funny thing. <laughs> or don't. <laughs> Maybe it's horrible and stupid. And I shouldn't even want credit for such a dumb, dumb thing. <laughs> But hey, I'm taking credit for this YouTube series, aren't I? <laughs> oh, gee. I hope that wasn't the person. I am thinking of the right person, right? Because there was Motor Runner, who, uh, you know, is no longer with us, as sad as that is. And then... Cook Cook. Violet. Oh, I need to go back there and try to loot her dog. I think her dog has like a brain. And I'm not going to use that dog brain, obviously, but I can pick it up and then I'll have Lupa's and Violet's. I guess Violetta. What kind of a freak names their dog after themselves? Like, hello, my name is Violet and this is my dog Violetta. Like, what? Hi, my name is May, and this is my dog, Mayoletta. Like, why would you? <laughs> I probably just offended everybody in the audience who's named their dog after themselves. Well, you know what? I'm not sorry. I'm not sorry, stay mad. <laughs> Produce sack. So we have anti-venom, tobacco, a mute fruit, potato noodle, pork and beans, purified water... I'm gonna take everything except the dirty water. I mean, I guess I can sell dirty water. But do I really want to waste time with that? I'm thinking no. I'm thinking no. Never mind, I will take it. That's pretty bad when three bottles of dirty water are worth as much as your armor is. Maybe I should, like, tell that to the fiends. What do you think? Well, it doesn't seem... Like the guy was even here. What did this tripwire even go to? Oh. Grenade bouquet. I don't think I have high enough. Okay, I do. Well, okay then. Um. Yeah. Yeah. 
All right, sledgehammer, huh? Nah. So I'm gonna go travel back to where Violet was. Can I? I mean, I can travel to the gas station. That's close enough. Really is close enough. I like how I had her run like all the way from her little base out to the station and then back in and then around. There we go, Violetta's brain. Cool. Let's put the weapon away. I actually think I will go ask for a hint about the location of the next person because I want to make sure that I'm even right about who it is. It's been so long since I took this quest and I haven't even... Human flesh. She's out here feeding her dogs human flesh. Okay. Yeah, she's like butchering these people and then feeding them to her dogs. Like, okay. Gross. Um, but yeah. I'll just ask. It's not like it's difficult to do. Ooh! I almost missed that magazine. How sad would that have been for a person who doesn't even use the magazines? <laughs> to miss a magazine. Whoopsie. I mean, that duplicate magazine perk thing is probably, like, pretty actually useful and fun to use. Maybe one day I'll try that. I don't know. Okay. Well, I... Th I think I'm probably done here. Like, this one just has baseballs and human flesh and dog bowls, so... I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that none of these have anything in them I'm gonna care about, really. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Well... Yeah, let's just go get our friends. These are just, like, dog-holding thingies. Ooh! And I was wrong. Phantoma Fixer. We have some missiles. Bottle caps. And what is gonna be in this toolbox? Stuff to make a weapon repair kit. Okay. Well, maybe these are worth looking in after all. Or maybe it was just that specific one. No, this one has boxes in it. Pre-war money. Caps and Wonder Glue. Hang on, guys. I just want to check the rest of these. I want to just make sure there's nothing else of interest. Dog stuff again? No, I'm not interested in the dog stuff. Come on, thing. Do something different than dog stuff. Nobody wants the dog stuff. Except the dogs. Do I look like... I might. <laughs> uh, sorry. Is that too much self-deprecating jokes? I don't know. Okay, um... <laughs> let's just go get our friends from over here. I'm sorry. <laughs> I cracked myself up. Yeah, let's get our friends and go. Because I think we're done. We're just gonna go to McCarran. We're gonna get the notes for how to get to the next place. And then we've got another person we can fight. And it'll be great. Did I miss anything over here in this section? I really don't think that I did. I looked at all the shells. Oh look, they're like cooking... ...stuff on the fire, in the trash fire. I don't know how. This is like a little bit magical, but... ...you know. They use energy weapons. Maybe they've harnessed a different type of energy. What do you think? Like crazy telepathy fiends running around shooting mind beams at you. It could be a thing. I mean, it's not, hopefully. Oh, I can kill these. Hi there. Come get me. Are your friends not at all disturbed? Okay, yeah, they are. There's you. Any of you guys have names? 
No, Fiend? What about you? Also Fiend? Okay, let's try an incredibly low chance to hit. Oh, come on. Hit him. No, no. Okay. There we go. Get closer. No! no! Oh, no! Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Let me take these things and oh no we finally got over encumbered it's a good thing some of these are the same type of thing so I'm gonna put probably the plasma rifles together yeah let's use the broken one and then let me just check the price on the laser RCW compared to the plasma rifle. I mean, it's it's actually worth more. Look, these two are like similar, you know, amounts. So now these are similar amounts. So we have 1,300 and 700. Wowee. Okay. And you... Another plasma rifle. I will use it. Super sim pack. You should have used that. And you. Hunting rifle. All this stuff. We're over encumbered again. So I will repair. Mm, maybe that. That's good enough for right now. I'll worry about the other weapons later. We are almost back to Boone and Eddie. They're right over here. Put our weapon away so we can move just a little faster. Still not a speed queen, but it's okay. So they are parked right over here just south of me. I almost went past them. Oh no! There they are! Okay, hi friends! Come with me to Camp McCarran, please. I would like to find the location of the last bounty person. If it's not Nephi, I'm gonna feel stupid. I've got your back. Thank you. I mean, I'm really pretty sure it was, but it's, uh, it's been such a long time since I got this quest! Ah, oh. whoa, hi. Hello. Hey there. Can I talk to you over his shoulder? Oh my goodness. Wait, wait. Uh-huh. No, stop. You've made it more difficult. I hope you're doing well, friend. Thank you. I'm trying to like Is your friend one of those elite troops we've been hearing I about? I hope you're doing well, friend. I wanted to talk to you but like over his shoulder. And yes, Boone is an elite troop. He's actually the best. The best for realsies? I'm convinced. Okay. Where are you at, my guy? There you are. Hello. I'm here to talk to you. Hello. Hi. I see you're still alive, and that's promising. Any luck on that bounty? Yep, I would like to claim a bounty. That right. You killed one of the psychopaths on my shit list. Let me see the scumbag's head. I worked God really hard. Damn it. That's violent. Keep it all right. You've made me one happy son of a bitch, you know that? Oh good. Here, this is the bounty I put on her head. It's yours. I have another Think you one. You can take down another one of these scumbags. Up to you. But I can trust you to do the job, and I'd hate to see you walk away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually have another one here. You killed another one. Let me have a look at the head. Yeah, that's Cook Cook. Ugh, did he always smell like this? Even Probably. Even before he was dead. Probably. And the fiends let this guy touch their food? I know, right? Well, this is payback for at least one of my troopers. She'll be glad to know he's dead. Here's your caps. That's two psychopaths dead. If you can bring down the third, there's a bonus in it for you. Oh yeah, I can totally do it. Yeah, it's Neffy. Tell me about Driver Neffy. Yeah, it's Driver because of the golf club thing. 
You've got some guts, I'll give you that. Nephi is one tough son of a bitch. You let him get close, and he'll take your head off. My advice is this. Talk to Lieutenant Gorobetz. He's in charge of Alpha Team, first recon. Snipers. Ooh. If you're lucky, you can lure Nephi into the open, and the sharpshooters can bring him down. You bring me the head, you'll still get the bounty. Awesome. It's a better bet than trying to take Nephi one-on-one, -on -one, but it's your call. I bet I could do it one-on-one -on -one and impress them. Where is he? Out in the yard. Gorobetz coordinates our sniper teams. He's been gunning for Nephi for weeks now. Only thing he hasn't had is willing bait. Don't have enough troops to order anyone beyond the fence. Not anymore, anyway. Got it. You've gone after the fiends before. I don't have to tell you to keep alert. Good luck. <laughs> the biggest danger to me out there was myself, but let's not tell him that. Um, okay. I think I'm good. Thank you. Right. Right? Idolized! Renowned for your extensive support and goodwill, I am idolized by the community. Finally! I really wanted the NCR to like me. Boon! 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 What is it? I'm an idol. What do you think about that? Nothing? Nothing? Boon! They idolize me! Yeah. Well, he doesn't seem so impressed, but I'm happy about it. So, I'm gonna say... That's enough progress for today. We will get rid of Nephi, or Nephi, whatever, next time. So I hope you will join me for that. Until then, please take care of yourself, and I will miss you. Bye.